Hello and welcome to my non-existent YouTube channel. Today we're going to review this Grizzly HEPA air filter. I didn't really see too many uh, reviews for this product online. I will show you the expensive $100 plus HEPA air filter it is wrapped in metal and it does have some foam on the sides. This is great, but this part up here and on the sides, it will rattle with your filter. I mean, with the filter in place, it's just going to rattle and be completely annoying to use. So I'll show a quick picture of the inside, put it back together, turn it on. Sorry, it's one-handed, but. Just kind of sits down in place. I'm not really sure what this next one is supposed to be filtering out, maybe bugs. Yeah, that's probably a good one, bugs. So you notice I also have this wind filter. Uh, it works great. Um, the one thing it does not 100% keep all the dust out. So about two years of using it and you can see that stuff is still getting sent out the back. So I wanted to upgrade to HEPA filter. Um, the side with the Grizzly logo is actually the exhaust side. So there's like a carbon filter in there. All in all, this has quite a few filters and they are quite pricey and there's friendly reminders for you to replace these $100 plus filters. Um, I still think it's worth it to breathe healthy air. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on for you now in auto mode so you can see I've been building this box for the past day. A little light dust on the floor. And then we're gonna turn it on and see you know how it sounds in auto mode one and then we'll go up to three just to see the difference uh, auto mode one goes at 400 cfm which is the equivalent of the wind the maximum is 620 cfm i've got a 19 by 19 garage um, i think it works great so let's turn it on and it's in auto mode because you can see the blue light air quality is green right now when i first got it Air quality stayed at uh, th a bad, so it lighted up red and stayed on three for about a day. I mean, ever since then, it's uh, been pretty good. Stayed on one, and now it's bumping up to three. Another feature I really like is the timer. So. The wind also has a timer, but the remote corroded in about a month, the batteries that came with it, and I'm not paying $20 for a replacement one, so really appreciate this one having a remote. Um, you can see all the technical info if you're interested. Probably go on the website and read it easier, but that's going to wrap this video. Thank you.